Okay, what is up you guys? <laughs> this is very exciting. I'm going to be watching To All The Boys I Love trailer. I'm so excited. I saw the little teaser they did. Um, and now this is the official trailer. The official trailer! I'm so excited. It's coming out August 17th. Is it coming out August 17th? If you search up To All The Boys I've Loved Before, my video comes up right there. I'm kind of shook. That's actually kind of crazy. Whatever. Um, yeah, to all the ways I love trailer reaction, I'm super hyped. This is exciting. I'm excited. I'm like sweating a little bit, but it's fine. Three, two, one. Junior year, and hardly believe it. Thanks, Dad. But we need to talk about your sexual health. No, no, please no. I want you to be safe. Dad, why are you giving me this? <laughs> Don't forget to have fun. Yes, well, I have a lot of rubbers for that, specifically. Maybe <laughs> you should branch out. Make some new friends. Yeah. You never know what could happen. That's what I'm afraid of. My letters are my most secret possessions. I write them when I'm most so up. intense. I don't know what else to do. There are five total. Peter, the most popular guy in school. Kenny from camp. Lucas from homecoming. John Ambrose from mom. Oh my god, like this is just... Josh, <laughs> but he's my sister's boyfriend. Gas. The drama. What are you doing? Nothing. Nobody else knows about them. No, no. Oh my god. <laughs> I squealed. Tell me about it. She pushed that boy down. So somebody else would think that like that. What if we let people think that we were actually the hand in the butt? Oh my god. That. Tell people how you feel when you feel it. Is she? Are they gonna change it a little bit? You never saw me. Oh my god! What just, um, what happened? just happened? She broke off the roof! What? Okay, I have to watch that one more time. She rolled off the roof! I'm gonna watch it again. Don't forget to have fun! Her dad's a OBGYN, right? Specific. Or a gynecologist or something like that. Branch out. Make some new friends. You never know what Margo. Is her name Margo? I forgot. There are five total. I love her set design on her room. I think it's really cool. From Cam and Josh. But he's my sister's boyfriend. Josh. Nothing. The boy next door that is not all that great. Oh, that's my opinion on Josh. He's not all that. Can I talk to you? It's Josh. Oh my god. More! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Women. Tell me about it. <laughs> Here's the thing. I had to make it look like I liked you so somebody else wouldn't think I liked them. What if we let people think that we were. Oh my god. Guys? How iconic. I've never seen you so happy. Did you mean when you wrote the letter? Just don't cry yourself. Oh my god! You can't just sit up in your room writing love letters. This is insane. You gotta tell people how you feel when you feel it. You're kidding! You never saw me. Girl, why? Ow. 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 Did she think she was like a fucking secret agent spy? <laughs> Okay, there's something that Josh says, like, it's it's weirdly, like, in the center of the trailer, so I want to hear it, because I, I, I wasn't paying attention. Did you mean what you wrote in the letter? I'm lying. Oh, he said, do you mean what you wrote in the letter? Oh my god! Josh, the motherfucker. Okay, okay. I always had an issue with Josh in the book, just because he's just like, everyone hyped him up so much, he wasn't all that great to me, and then when he comes back in the middle or whatever, and he's like... Oh God, only if I knew you felt this way. And it's just like, can you stop? Like, and it looks like they are speeding it up 
to around the second book as well because I see John coming to her door um, which is kind of cool from the looks of the trailer it when someone is talking I forget who it is it might be Lucas that's talking sounds like it'd be Lucas that's talking because Lucas is always the one to kind of like call her out on her BS um, but whenever they're on the field I don't know if they're gonna make that a confession scene or whatever I don't know but the way she was walking was really cute okay <sighs> Also, why was Peter on the field with literally nothing around? Like, it looks like he's supposed to be practicing. There's no balls, no racket, nothing. He's just there with a, a goal. So, I don't know what that's about. Yeah, it looks like they're bringing in, like, John, which I think is going to be interesting because it kind of takes parts from the second book as well. It, by the looks of it, it looks like it takes parts from the second book. But I love this cast so much. Can we watch the part where she just kisses him? Oh my god, it's Josh. Oh my god, I hope Honestly, I said that I was really looking forward to the part where she jumps on him in the hallway But I think this might be like this works too because it looks like Josh is coming here And then she just like pulls him down and honestly, I think they did a good choice there because I heard in an interview with uh, Nick, I think Noah. I keep calling him Nick I don't know why, but I keep calling him Nick. His name is Noah. When Noah <laughs> did an interview, he said that they had to cut that part out because it just didn't make sense uh, by the way that they were filming things, which I kind of agree with because this takes place when they're running, not in the school by the lockers. So it makes sense for it to kind of be this way instead. But I like the decision that they made. I, you know, I think it is sad that we missed out on the whole large Jean running up on Peter, but I think this also works out pretty well because it kind of makes sense in context to what's happening. I love the set design on everything in this. Oh, I think it's so good. God, I really love this. I also like the part where he puts his hand. I said, whenever I was reacting, I said in her butt. Did not mean that. In her pocket. I, th I think that's a really cool like scene that they did because in the book it was written in the contract I think or something like that or they discussed it but it never actually happened or at least I don't think so I don't remember reading that scene I read that book like three times by now and I don't remember there being a scene where he puts his hand in her pocket um but I know they talked about it but they, I don't think they ever did it in the book but I think that's a really cool thing I I think by the looks of the trailer I think that Lana and Noah have pretty good on-screen chemistry and uh, like a good dynamic throughout the scenes so far from the trailer. So I'm really excited about that. I like the actor that's playing Josh. I think he fits the role really well. I'm so excited for this. Like I don't, I don't think I can tell you guys how excited I am for this. Like this, I've heard nothing but positive reviews from people that have already seen it. So that makes me happy. Even people that have read the books and people that have not read the books. So I'm really, really excited for this. Obviously. I think this story will change a little bit even just by the looks of the trailer it looks like the story has changed a little bit to fit you know filmmaking all that stuff because you know it's not gonna be perfect to the book which I don't really care about for me I've never really cared about book adaptation films matching the book perfectly as someone that's read the book I don't really care that much I just hope it's a good movie that's all I really care about is if it's a good movie if it entertains me if it hits my emotions really well, all that stuff. I don't really care if it's spot onto the book, so. It looks pretty dang similar to the book. It looks like it's following pretty much the same route, but I'm so excited. I think it's gonna be so good from the trailer, from the photos, from everything, from how people have been talking about it. I'm so freaking excited. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please let me know your thoughts on the trailer in the comment section down below. I hope you guys are excited as I am because this looks so good and I just like, usually trailers don't make me like this. Actually, I take that back. Love, Simon made me a fucking mess. So this is like pretty normal for me, but like I couldn't be happier and more excited for this. Like I'm genuinely like so freaking excited for it. Not only that I loved the books, but also to finally see a teen movie with an Asian lead. I think that's super amazing. And I think it's a, you know, it's like a small step, but it's a step and I'm so freaking hyped. I can't say enough how high I am for it. Like, I, it's gonna be so good. Okay, I need to go because I'm like rambling, but thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and let me know your thoughts on this trailer in the comment section down below. Leave me anything else you would like me to react to in the comment section below as well. See you little lovebirds later. Bye!